it is a pleasant day to you out there, my Amiibo viewers. You are welcome to this interesting and educative platform where we discuss literature and other relevant topics. This particular video is about an idiomatic expression. About an idiomatic expression that is rainy cats and dogs. Rainy cats and dogs. We research on the origin. We talk about the meaning and the usage of this idiom that is rainy cats and dog. Let's look at these uh, short clips to see how it is rainy cats and dog. Really? Yes. Then we can see this. You can see that it's really rainy cats and dogs here. Yeah. Now let's not look at the meaning. What is the meaning? Where is the origin of this idiomatic expression? The idiom once again is rainy cats and dogs. Now let's go into the classroom. Rainy cats and dogs means every rain. When it is raining heavily, we say it is rainy cats and dogs. Let's look at the background story. Here's the background story, meaning and usage of rainy cats and dogs. The background story. The origin of rainy cats and dogs is uncertain. The origin of rainy cats and dogs is uncertain. But several theories exist that tell us about this idiomatic expression, that tells us about the origin of this idiomatic expression. One, we have the medieval folklore. In medieval Europe, every rain will cause the street to flood, washing away dead animals and debris. This gruesome sight led people to believe that cats and dogs were falling from the sky. So they believed that cats and dogs were falling from the sky that time. Two, we also have Norse mythology. The Norse god Odin was often depicted with dogs and cats, symbols of wind and rain. During storms, these animals were believed to be swept off by the wind, creating the illusion of rainy cats and dogs. So they believe that cats and dogs fought from the sky that time. 3. We also have 17th century England. 17th century England. Another theory suggests that the phrase came from 17th century England. Where every rain will cause the thatch roofs of homes to leak, and cats and dogs will be swept out of the houses, creating appearance of animals falling from the sky. That is when the house is looking uh, is leaking. So, cats and dogs will be forced out of the houses. So do not believe that these animals were falling from the sky. Now let's look at the meaning. Rainy cats and dogs means raining very heavily to the point where it's almost impossible to stay outside without getting so. Usage 1. To describe every rain, it's rainy cats and dogs outside, let's stay indoors. That is, it is raining heavily outside, let's stay indoors. 2. To emphasize the intensity of a storm. The hurricane is bringing rains that rainy cats and dogs be careful. 3. Figuratively, to describe a situation of a woman someone. Let's look at that. I'm getting tags thrown at me left and right. It's rainy cats and dogs. We also have the variations. Rainy buckets. Rainy pitchforks. This one is less common. Coming down in sheets. Describing everything that is describing how the rain uh, is coming down. Pouring rain. We also have the idiomatic equivalent. It's pouring. It's coming down in torrents. The sky is crying. A deluge of rain. That is just the description of every rain. There are some cultural significance. Rain cats and dogs has become a universal expression. Highlighting the one intensity of every rain, two power of nature, three importance of seeking shelter. 
that is where it is really it's very important to seek shelter to hide somewhere interesting fact this phrase has been in use since at least the 17th century it is used in many languages including french spanish and german the phrase has inspired various artistic works including music literature and film in conclusion by understanding the background story meaning and usage of rainy cats and dogs we can better appreciate the creative ways language describes the natural world so that's the uh, analysis the explanation of rainy cats and dog now if you are new on this platform please try and click on the subscribe button so that we are part of this class and whenever any video is produced you are going to be notified and also i'm going to leave my social media links in the description of this video so you can connect with me through those links so if you have any question you can ask your question through the comment section and it will be attended to invite your friends and colleagues to general because we have a lot to gain on this platform thank you and god bless let's meet in the next class